Hello, hello, and welcome to the Vader Smash League Championship Playoffs Round 1. We are glad and happy that you are joining us today. Can you please give me verification that you can hear this live on the stream? Sonny, please. Let me get my verification. I believe you can. Perfect. We welcome everybody that's joining us tonight. You are witnessing Vader House history, folks. This is the beginning of the end of our very first Vader Smash League. I'd like to thank everybody, everybody that's participated so far. We had uh, 15 participants in this first Smash League. We've narrowed it down to eight. Before we get in to uh, exactly uh, the, the matches, I'd like to just give a couple breakdowns for you guys. First of all, let's go into uh, those people that will be in our championship round. This right here is our final standings. The, the regular season consisted of uh, 30 games. Uh, there was a double round robin tournament. Of those 30 games, eight people advanced, oh, I'm sorry, of those 15 teams, eight people advanced. Those eight people are as follows. Coming in eighth, Raylo. Seventh, Q No Rap Name. Sixth, Panda Prince. Five, Infallible 106. Four, Pandoxian. Three, Sunny. Two, Calvi Baby. And one, Foxborough. Now, you might take notice, Foxborough is currently undefeated heading into this playoff round, the heavy favorite. But that doesn't mean that we can't see an upset here, folks. If you look at the bracket, the bracket is seeded as well. Tonight we will be seeing two of these four games in the first round. Those games are Pandoxian and Infallible, as well as Calvi Baby and Q No Rap Name. Tomorrow night we will come back, we will do uh, Sunny vs. Panda Prince, Foxborough vs. Raylo. For now, we will look at some of the rules of these playoffs. Now, traditionally, in our uh, regular season, we did a best of five series, four stock. Things aren't going to be too different this time around. So the rules for this playoff are as follows. It's a best of seven, a single elimination, four stock, eight minutes. And there are select maps that are legal and select maps that are illegal. Uh, in addition to these rules, uh, I will be acting as referee. I will be acting as referee in this uh, tournament just to see, for the pure reason to see if there's any lag, uh, because we are playing online. Uh, that is possible. Um, if there is lag that is uh, kind of interfering with the match, um, we will replay that match. Sorry, had to make a quick fix there. Uh, our first game of the night is going to be Pandoxian versus Infallible. Unfortunately, my arena got shut down, so I'm going to give them just a couple more minutes to jump back in here. Uh, let's While we wait for them, let's take a look at what stages are legal and not legal. So you can see here anything highlighted. That is our legal matches. Uh, we will stop the match if somebody happens to use an illegal match. Most people, they play with Final D or Battlefield. Uh, but these matches, or, I'm sorry, these stages, they're all legal and they're all uh, able to be used. Uh, it looks like both of our first game's competitors have jumped into the uh, into the arena. Let's see here. Let's give them just a couple more minutes to select their characters. We'll tune in live right now. Transition over. Transition over into the battle arena. Any better, Sonny? I can, I can control it. Test, test, test. Perfect. Great. Okay. Well, it looks like we're about to take off. I'm going to be commentating to the best of my ability. Um, we will see how this shakes down. 
please, after this match, stay tuned. We do have another one coming up. Waiting patiently for this match to begin. While we wait, I'd like to thank, again, everybody that's tuned in right now, watching this stream live, as well as anybody who participated in the uh, regular season of our league. Um, I know, you know seven of us didn't make the cut, but I'm hoping that they're still watching. They have a favorite, uh, favorite competitor that they're rooting for through all this. And if not, that's okay too. There's always the next, next round, right? Here we go. We've got Infallible 106, Max Kasky, he's Ganondorf, Panda Print, I'm sorry, Pandoxian is Rosalina. And we are off to the races, folks. And Rosalina, I mean, what a babe. Sunny has Sunny has stakes stakes in uh, in Pandoxian over Max. Ooh, a good recovery there. Hello, Josh. Very good. How are you today? Thank you for tuning in. Ganondorf with the heavy hit off the ledge. Recovery from Ganondorf. I'm sorry if the stream is a little laggy. There's not much I can do there. Ganondorf takes the early lead in this round. Ooh, and a good kill. We're, we're back to square one here, folks. Three stock first, three stock. Again, if the, if the stream. Stream is lagging a little bit on their end. We will do a playthrough. Again, we are working with Nintendo servers here, folks. It is far from, far from the best servers on the planet, but we will do our best. Oh, and good recovery once again. Rosalina. Ganondorf misses on the punch. Oh, that's going to be three to two Rosalina so far. Ganondorf has that heavy hit. It just takes one heavy hit. Rosalina's out of here. And that's the heavy hit that Ganondorf was looking for. We're 2-2 two, two stop. Rosalina comes out of the gate. Or the gate and the stock. Ooh, a good move from Rosalina. Is that going to be enough to take Ganondorf off of the map? It is. That is 2-1. Rosalina is in the lead. We're down to the final life in this round. Will Rosalina round this one out? Oh, Ganondorf recovers with just a nick of time. Another close call there. Ganondorf definitely on the ropes here. The recovery is good. Swift kick. Throws off the Ganondorf off the map. Is it going to be enough? And it is. And Rosalina Pandoxian taking the first. The first win in this seven series. And what a win it was. I've lost my scoreboard here, folks. Pandoxian leaves one nothing. Now, at the end of each round, we do, we do allow players to change characters if they so choose. It is up to them. It is at their discretion. But what a round that was.
I'm gonna text Q. Get him out of here. I don't know if I can kick Q out of here or not. Oh, it looks like Q might have left, actually. He did. We're off. While this match goes on, I'm going to actually try and work on our scoreboard here. I'm having a little bit of technical difficulties. Bear with me, folks. I'll have that updated for you in just a second. Pokemon Stadium. I would like to also note that this, that all of these stages, they do not have hazards on. So do not worry about that. I do not know that for our scoreboard, folks. I apologize. I'll get this taken care of. And another early, early, early point on the board for Panda of uh, Pandoxian. He's up one nothing in the series. But I know Max. I know Infallible. He is you cannot count him out. Ooh. Another good recovery. It's amazing how he can recover with Ganondorf. I cannot play Ganondorf for anything. I, I'm a three-character chump. That's the way I've always played Smash. It is Team Kirby. It is Team Pikachu. Oh! And Pandoxian takes a fall. Don't count Max out. I mean, he is a hell of a competitor, folks. Max takes a lead here. They're tied 2-2 in this series. Rosalina loses her star friend. Gobble with the kick, misses with the hammer throw. Oh, another kick off the edge. And Max takes the lead once again, two to one. Can Pandoxian make up this gap? And there's your scoreboard. I got it back up, just in the nick of time. Just in time for it to get messed up again when I update it in just a couple minutes here. And Oxian fighting for his life here. Ooh, a good, good down smash from Ganondorf. I am known to rock stone. That is true, Josh Reagan. Oh, man! And a hell of a move from Infallible to tie this series one to one. We are tied, folks. Remember, I will reiterate it's a best of seven. We're tied one one. Here, game three. Q, you can special guest uh, ref if you like. I'm fine with that. I am looking. I am actively looking for uh, for guest commentators throughout this adventure we will take this week. Then 
dog team taking taking early damage in this round. Ganondorf takes a fall early. But Rosalina does have significant damage. One hit from Ganondorf, and, and that's going to be a stock loss. Sonny, I hope you feel better. Hoping you're well enough to play tomorrow. Ooh, Ganondorf. Going above and beyond. Take out Rosalina. Raylo is joining us on the screen. Hello, Ray. Thank you for joining. Again, folks, we have a best of seven series on our hands. The first game in the Vader Smash Bros. Championship. We are looking to crown our first champion here this week. Good move from Rosalina to knock Ganondorf off of the map. Smash from Ganondorf capitalizes the punishment right then and there. We got plenty of games here, folks. Series tied 1 1. Infallible 1 is just looking to even the score here with Ganondorf. Make up a little bit of ground before we head into the final stop here in game three of uh, the quarterfinals. Not unable to recover, Ganondorf takes the hit once again. Rosalina leads this series 2-1. to one. Let's see if Ganondorf can make up. As soon goes the Dynamite. Q, you are on point. That is right. Rosalina takes Game 2 Pandoxian with the second win in the series. There's still time, folks. We can still bring this back for Ganondorf. I don't know why the scoreboard has reset. But we are going to figure it out. There we go. Much better, much better. This is their third game. So, Pandoxian leads. This is the first game of two tonight. Pandoxian leads two to one in the series. Okay, folks, 99 is, but here's your shout out. I like your I like your username because I say okay, folks, way too much in this. I don't know if that's a, a knock on me or not, but if it is, kudos to you.
It shouldn't be lagging in game too much, uh, Brandy. It shouldn't be. Uh, but if it does lag, um, I know I've said it a couple times, uh, if there's a lag and it's bad for both people competing, we will replay that game uh, just in the sake of, sake of fairness. And, uh, okay, folks, if you can tell me who you are, I would appreciate that. <laughs> I, love, I love your username. It's pretty great. Sorry about that dim. Uh, Nintendo is stupid. <laughs> Which is... Uh, Both competitors, just about one hit away from from hit, losing their first stop here. And Doxian is going to take the early lead. Damage on Gandalf from Gandalf for cover. He can. Gandalf has some serious ground to make up. Ooh. Great KO from Rosalina. She leads this game by one stock as it stands now. Still five. Just over, just under six minutes. Just under six minutes left in this match. Uh, I hear Chips is not Mad Booty at Luigi. While I have not played as Luigi in Ultimate very much, I, I will absolutely whoop your ass with Luigi in uh, Brawl. So, and I'm, I know who OK Pulse is now. Uh, hello, Wheeler. <laughs> hello, Andrew Wheeler. I hear that OK Folks 99 does not drink any beers as well. I've heard the same thing. In fact, you might be hearing it first here, folks. Uh, OK Folks 99 drinks no beers. And Ganondorf is able to knock off Sandoxian, but he's still down 2 to 1. 72%. That is now 92%. We're getting down to the wire, folks. Is that going to be enough? Oh, Ganondorf recovers. That's going to be it. Pandoxian leads the series 3 to 1. Rosalina coming through the clutch, clutch KOs. Um, tomorrow, if possible, I got to figure out some stuff with that. Sunny with some some colorful insight, saying Max needs to pick a different character. He has the ability to to, to and I think he's going to now. Uh, Ganondorf might just be a little bit too slow for Rosalina. While, while powerful, still nonetheless slow. And uh, while I personally don't like Ganondorf's recovery, Max has done a good job at recovering with Ganondorf. Let's see who he picks. He's going to switch to Roy now. Three, two, Jigglypuff would be a bold one, move. Gonna stick with Roy, and we're off to the races here. One more win with Rosalina for Pandoxian, and he's gonna advance to the semifinals, which take place on Thursday night, same time, 9 p.m. here on Twitch TV slash Vader House. Once again, I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in. We do have another game after this. You're going to have Q, no rap name, go against Calvi Baby. 
Both of these competitors playing right now had a pretty good season. Max finished. I believe Max finished fifth. And Doxie in fourth. Chips play no Dota. <laughs> I do not play Dota. I don't play Dota. I don't play League of Legends. I play Animal Crossing and Minecraft. <laughs> and uh, City Skylines. And uh, Tales of the Dota. And that's it. <laughs> and nothing else. Most players here high percentiles and, and Rosalina's gonna get knocked off the map. Star is absolutely deadly. We are tied here. Three three. Six and a half minutes left in this game. Ooh, a good counter. Boy. Rosalina's gonna lose the star, but will recover from that move. Boy with the recovery, but he's got to turn the tides here. It's three to two. Rosalina in the lead. He's got to do something to make up serious ground. Rosalina, three stocks, still only 65% damage. Series three to one. Two to one, correction. This is could be Max's last life of the tournament if he does not make a comeback here. Sixty-eight percent with one stock left. He's on his last leg, 110% with one stock left. Is that going to be it? Is that going to be it? And it will be Pandoxian will advance to the next round, the semifinals. And this, the Smash Tournament, our Vader Smash League. And just like that, Pandoxian will advance to either play Calvi Baby or Q No Rap Name, depending on what happens next. Just like that, folks. Give us a second. We're going to wait just a minute here. Set up our next game. We've got Kuno Rap Name versus Calvi Baby. We're just waiting for the competitors to enter the arena. I'd like to thank everybody once again for tuning in live here at Vader House. Coming live from my bedroom. With me in the room, Anthony Anderson, folks. Let's give him a round of a hand. Thank you, I know. He appreciates it more than you'll ever know. I'm blushing. He's blushing.
we're going to let them select characters. Let's go over. Let's let's enter the arena. Whoa, my scoreboard, way too big here. I do need to make a new scoreboard. Oh my gosh. This is. There's got to be a better way to do a score scoreboard here, but we'll never learn. Again, folks, coming live from the Vader Smash League uh, Championship Playoffs. This is round two. Uh, now, I do expect a little bit of lag here. This queue is playing from San Francisco. And again, if the lag gets too bad or it's just unplayable, we're going to restart this. Restart this series. At least, at least restart the game. But let's hope it doesn't get to that point. Now, Q, Q is very good. He plays as... Uh, Black Link, because Zelda does not have black characters. I gotta commend him for that. Calvi, on the other hand, also very, very good. Plays as Rob, because uh, Zelda does not have robots in it, and that does bother him quite a bit. So uh, We're gonna see how these two, these two shake out. Calvi finished second in the tournament, two, seventh, defeating Gabby last night to lock in his seventh seed. I've seen Calvi play as Banjo-Kazooie. I don't know if we'll see an appearance tonight. I personally have gotten absolutely wrecked. Wrecked by Calvi Banjo-Kazooie. Uh, Calvi's going to take the early lead here with Rob. 74%. Four stocks still. Here he just losing his, his first life. I will say this. i got to admire... Q's dedication to Link's arrows. Ooh, an early death from Q. Calvi still with four stock. Q2. here and make up a little bit of ground. I gotta say, one more kill from, from Rob here, and this might be out of reach for Q. Waited for that one. seeing a little bit of lag here. Ooh. We'll leave it up to the contestants. Contestants to say if this is worth restarting or not, but at this point, I would say Rob has the early advantage, obviously, being up 4-1 to one with 144%. Here. Rob still at 154% for stock. You gotta wonder, will Rob even lose a life in this? And he will not. And Rob will take the first game here, Calvi Baby, with the first, first win of this series.
And here we are, game two. Hugh sitting idly by. Not, not quite sure what the strat is here, but I'm sure we'll find out in time. I believe that they have there's a budding romance starting to form between these two fierce competitors. Oh, and they're back at the action. Here we are. We're off to the races, folks. It took 30 seconds, but we're in it. This is a love story for the, the end of time, folks. This is something that we'll they'll, they'll make a notebook sequel about this one. Ooh. A recovery from Rob, just unbelievable recovery. Link is going to get the first kill in this series. And he's taken 37 damage to this point. Still 4 stock, 56% damage for Link. 28% damage for Rob. 3 stock. A great opportunity for Q to, to take a win here. If he can hold firm throughout his next 3 stocks. Ooh! A great move from Rob to knock Link out of this out of this arena. We're tied 3-3. Link still has the advantage on percent points. Hugh's gonna have to play it smart as so. Ooh, and we're tied. Again, spoke a little too soon. Browser difficulty, but I'm back, back in it. Here commentating live from my bedroom at Vader House in beautiful sunny Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. It is dark out as I speak. <laughs> We've got 13 spectators watching this stream from, I would imagine, all across the globe. Scratch that. 14 people now watching this stream live. I'd like to thank you all for joining us. Calvi reinstates the lead, but does have 150% damage. And that'll be enough for Q to knock Rob off of the map. 2-2, folks. Not so sure if New Jersey's better than everything. It's better than some things, yes, but let's do a poll, let's, let's do a survey. We'll survey all 13 of us here. What's better than New Jersey? Tell me in the chat. I'd love to know. Will you make your, state your case. Thank you, 84%. Calvi baby, 55. Calvi's gonna take the lead once again. This is Q's last life. I'm not disparaging New Jersey, folks. I'm just here to state the facts. New Jersey's good. Uh, better than everything. I don't know. I mean, cheesecake is pretty good. Um, I like bike rides. I'd probably say that's better than New Jersey some days. Uh, but you tell me in the comments. What's better than New Jersey? Is anything better than New Jersey? I don't know if New Jersey's better than cheesecake. I'm not so sure. Rob still with one, still with two lives here. Is that going to be enough to knock you off? It will be. And Calvi is going to take this lead two to nothing. Juan is pretty great, and I would say probably better than New Jersey. There we go. Now we're all agreeing on something. Glad we can find common ground, folks. 
Apparently, all this New Jersey hate has made it so that we've lost two viewers, but that's okay. I'm glad you're still all with me. It looks like Calvi's going to take this time, change characters. Let's see if uh, he selects that banjo pick that I was discussing earlier. Absolutely destroyed me. I was going to stay with Rob. A wise move. He's been doing great with him so far. Calvi leads this series 2 to nothing. Whoever wins this, whoever wins this, will go on to verse Pandoxian on Thursday night in the semifinals. We're off here. Game three of seven. Could be three of four, potentially. Once again, Q is going to take, take some early damage on Rob. He's going to be at, he's going to have to sustain that for four stops. It's not going to be easy, but he is definitely capable. last night taking down Gabby to secure the seventh seed and the right to play Calvi in this round. And that'll be an early KO for Rob. Q still standing with Link at 42% damage. Four stop. Calvi's also known to be Pretty brutal with Pokemon Trainer. I'm surprised he's sticking with Rob through all of this, but you know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. That's what my dad always told me. And uh, apparently that quip has made it so that we've lost another streamer, but 10 people Hi, still thank, I would like to thank Greg for us losing that, that one view, but it's okay, folks. There's still 10 of us here watching in anticipation as Calvi takes on Q here. Q with 84% damage, Calvi 90%, three stocks, four. That's gonna be Link's first KO, but not before Link lays 108 damage on Rob. That was Ant, ladies and gentlemen, joining me live in my bedroom, not on mic. Tomorrow night, he will be joining me on commentary, I hope. I'm hoping to figure that out. But for night, for right now, you'll be able to hear him burp in all his glory as he sits on my bed and watches this game with me. I apologize for the fade out there for a second. What can I say? Nintendo just really knows how to, how to make streams watchable servers or screen timeouts, they are masters of their craft. Hugh taking a, a KO early in that last that last bout, giving Calvi the lead. Five just over five minutes left in this round. Match. Calvi sits at 139% damage. Hugh can kill Calvi here. He was a very good shot at bringing this back. He's gonna have to play it smart and stay, stay away a little bit, but. Block. 169%. Is that gonna be enough to kill him? It will be. He stocks all. Q currently has 84 damage. Rob, 31. That move now knocking Q to 102 damage. Ooh, and a tough, tough KO. Tough KO on for Link. <laughs> Ant described that as Rob Furry. Classic Ant pun. Oh, and a brutal way to, to drop three, but there's still one more. There's still a chance. We head into this, our potential final match of the night I'd like to thank everybody for joining us one last time hopefully Q can can extend this make him go the distance if not Q 
you. It, it ain't easy, but we still love you. You're still in this. Three, two, We're going to perpetually end this go. here. The Animal Crossing stage. I, I said, uh, I, I, I will not let you pinch my nipples. Okay, folks, 99. But I do have an OnlyFans account, and if you'd like to subscribe, you are more than welcome to do so. I will pinch my nipples for you for a small, small subscription fee of $15 a month. I do not have to let him do anything. It's my body, my choice. But if you want to subscribe to my OnlyFans, go on OnlyFans.com backslash Vader House. Uh, we all have pages on there. It's pretty great. Great content. You won't need therapy if you go on my, my OnlyFans account. It's pretty awesome. I will say there is a lot of hair. But past that, you're, you're really in for some treats. Let's get back to the action. Rob is going to take the first kill in this round. Three players. Oh, and Q's going to equalize. Rob, three lives away from advancing to the semifinals. Q, three lives away from staying alive. Another match, breathing another day. Once again, please join us tomorrow night. Same time, 9 o'clock, we will be doing the other two games in this, the quarterfinals of the Vader Smash League Championship, our first Smash League Championship. There is a belt on the line, you will have a championship belt, it will be glorious. There will be spaghetti on it at some point, but not today, not today. He's going to have to recover there, and he does in a great fashion. If I had a Pikachu outfit, I would absolutely commentate on it. If you guys would like to see me commentate, I can set up my webcam. I will set up a beard cam. It will be great. It will just be my chin. Just my mouth. I will zoom heavily in on my mouth. It will be very unsettling and distracting. Yeah, just my mouth in the corner of the screen. Uh, my actually the whole the whole screen will be my mouth and we'll put the we'll put the the smash game in the corner because I know I know what you guys came to see and I know what you guys came to see again sorry about sorry about the the dim I don't know how to turn that off on the switch I tried everything and it just does not work got a tight match here Q's gonna take a, another lead here three to two still have 155 damage so one big hit from Rob, and you gotta imagine he was out of here. 173 damage. This is a great time for Q to get some, some extra damage on Rob as he sits at 183 damage. Rob's got 37 damage. T stock. Ooh, Q is gonna kill himself there. Tough to see. We're tied 2 2. Q has the advantage, but only by 47%. Playing the cards tight to his chest. Good dodge there. He's going to take a 2-1 lead. Rob has some serious ground to make up if he hopes to sweep Q. wasn't many many rounds that Calvi lost in the regular season and he's able to bring this to an equalizer we could have a photo finish here folks just under four minutes left one one stock we've got some, some people rallying in the chat for Q forty four to fifty one percent here Q's gonna, Q's gonna take it to 57, 59, one stock each.
Is that going to be it? That'll be it for Q. A tough, tough kill. But that'll be enough to secure Calvi's spot in the semifinals on Thursday night. You got to admire the way Calvi plays it. You got to admire the way that Q stuck through it to the end. It was a tough, tough loss there. But Q is an amazing competitor. He'll bounce back in the next round. And that's going to do it for tonight, folks. Let's take a look at the bracket one last time. And there you have it. Calvi and Pandoxian will play. They'll meet on Thursday night. Here in the Vader Smash League Championship, the winner of that will go on to the finals to play one of the four competitors you see on the left. Tomorrow night we have two great games lined up. Uh, the first game will be Sunny versus Panda Prince in a match that I know will be just epic. And then we will have Foxborough versus Ray. Foxborough going undefeated. Ray hoping to to take that blem put a blemish on that record. And knock him out early in this, the Vader Smash League Championship bracket. I really do appreciate everybody coming, watching the stream tonight. Uh, I will upload this later. Uh, again, tomorrow night, 9 o'clock, uh, we will be doing another stream. Uh, then the semifinals will be Thursday. And we will probably have the championship on Saturday night. Uh, until then, I thank you guys so much. And I hope you all have a great night. Thank you. Goodbye.